Okay, this stuff can be a little bit tricky, but if you're paying real close attention, it's not too bad. This says solve each equation for the indicated variable. All that means is we want to get the variable, in this case A, by itself. So let me go ahead and erase that stuff so you know what I'm talking about. So we want to get that A right there by itself. Before you can get to that A, there's this negative 4 um, not attached to A. You want Whatever's attached to A, you wait till the very end. Uh, it's the reverse order of operations. So you take the stuff not attached to A and you get rid of that first. So how do you cancel a, a negative A? What's the inverse of negative A? That would be right. That would be I'm A positive negative 4. You would add positive 4 to both sides. Here, we'll, I'll do it in a different color. So we're going to add 4 here, and that cancels that. And then we'll add 4 right there. And when we simplify, it looks just like this. Okay, well now the A, the only thing that's left is there's a multiplying negative 4. How do you cancel a multiplying negative 4? What's the inverse of multiplication? Division. And when you divide this side, you divide the entire this side. But here's the catch. Let's see if we, yep, yeah. I went ahead and did that. The catch is when you divide, well, when you divide the right side, that cancels, and then the A is by itself. But on the left side, we never want a negative sign in the denominator. So you just have to ask yourself, what is positive u divide by negative? What's a positive divide by negative? A negative. So this sign changes. And what's pos this positive divide by negative? A negative. So this sign changes. And when you have all those signs changed, this sign changes. So the simplification would be negative u subtract 4 all divided by 4. That's what a is equal to. Okay, and you can pause that if you need to. And we're going to do this one over here. So this says we again need to get a by itself. This says u is equal to 8a. Well, if all we have to do is get 8 by a by itself, well, the inverse of this multiplying 8 is 2 divide 8. 8 divide 8 is 1, so that leaves a. u divide 8, you would just leave it as u divide 8. All right, that's, that's it.